watching News 24 Live, we're down at Big Bay Beach for the Red Bull King of the Air kite surfing competition. The window opened for this on the 31st of January and the guys have had to wait 12 days for the right wind. They expect it to start in about half an hour. Maybe later I'm joined by South African champion Oswald Smith. He's going to preview today's action for us, hopefully. Oswald, yeah. welcome. And um, is it looking likely to kick off at uh, 3 o'clock? Um, well, hopefully the wind's going to come through. You know, like Cape Town wind, Southeasters always come through in the evening. So, yeah, hopefully the wind's going to come through and we can see some, you know, some big jumps. But we'll have to see, uh, hopefully. So, I mean, we, we can see uh, just behind us here, there's obviously a lot of kite surfers out in the water already. But this tournament is all about big air. So you guys need really strong wind, eh? Yeah, well, ideally we're looking for about 30 knots of wind. And right now it's probably 17, maybe gusting to 20. So, you know, we're getting there, but when you want to go big, you need, to, you need a lot of wind. So that's what we're waiting for. Okay. Just quickly give us your sort of CV, I believe you, the, the, the reigning South African champion. What else uh, have you, you got under your belt recently? Um, yeah, I'm reigning South African champ, um, two times African champ, um, current vice world champ, and yeah, that's about it. <laughs> but it's sick. I'm enjoying guiding. It's sick. I guess pretty impressive. So, so the, obviously a huge international field here. Yeah. Who are some of the guys to look out for? Who are you? I believe you're not taking part. You, you nursing a bit of an injury. Who are you looking forward to watching? And and who do you think are, are going to be the danger man? Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not competing because of my shoulder up. But right now, like all the riders are very good here. I'm looking out for like Aaron Hadlow, five times world champion. Ruben Lenton, you know, he's known for going big. And then obviously last year's winner, Kevin Langry. So I think there's, you know, there's a, good, a strong group of people and I think it's going to be a good show. Looking forward to it. Okay, um, and then tomorrow's wind and Friday's, I mean, do, do you guys inevitably compete this in one or two days? Um, well, I think it's going to be two days, the competition. We won't be able to finish today. And tomorrow the wind even looks, the prediction looks better. So, you know, action's going to be better and, you know, we'll see. I don't know. It's mother nature. You never know, dude. <laughs> of course. And then, I mean, as an event, I believe this is the third time Big Bay has hosted the, the, the King of the Air. Uh, spectators, the sort of um, the attention that it's getting from the public. I mean, what, what, what are you guys expecting this year? Um, we definitely expect like a lot of people to be, a, you know, come support. I mean, it's kite putting at its most extreme. Guys are jumping, you know, 20 meters up in the air. So 25 actually, yeah, it's big. But yeah, it's definitely something to check out. And it's an awesome venue. Everyone's chilling right here on the beach, on the grass. There's flipping restaurants, whatever you want, it's here.